All right, next Monday marks 22 years since one of the saddest days in American history. Thousands of lives lost in the September 11th attacks on New York City, including hundreds of first responders who ran directly into the face of danger and terror that day, risking their lives trying to save others. Now, coming up though, this Saturday, just a week now, CentOS is hosting the National Fallen Firefighter Foundation 9-11 Memorial Stair Climb. That's happening at TQL Stadium. And joining us is a woman who has been heavily involved <laughs> in the climbs each year. Jennifer Rui, so good to have you here in the studio. By the way, I got to say, Jennifer, by the way, uh, was at the Oktoberfest over the weekend. The best Bengals drone girl <laughs> I've ever seen. Looked amazing. Looked amazing. Thank you. All right. So I know you're heavily involved here with the National Fallen uh, Firefighters Association. Yes. How'd you get involved, first of all? Um, I became involved really when we lost two firefighters, uh, two coin firefighters, is when I became aware uh, back in 2008. And your husband's a firefighter, yes. right? So you are personally very involved in here. Yes. You know what it's like when these men suit up and women and go into these buildings because it, every single situation is different. Right, right. And I, the morning of September 11th, I remember hearing the news and I was thinking that's going to be a tough call for them to make to get into that building and try to find the source of the fire and put it out and help whoever. And of course, nobody thought in their wildest. I, I was living in New York City when that happened and still can't believe it. I lived all the way through it. That, uh, that something that big and that tall was going to come down. No one, that was in no one's minds that right. day. Yeah, nobody thought the towers would collapse at that point. So you guys do these memorial stair climbs, and I noticed you have a couple different badges of fallen firefighters in front of you. Who do we have here? So uh, first we have Robert Foddy, and I was able to meet his mother, Mo Rose, at a memorial event in Colorado Springs. She was there in 2002 when her son was being memorialized for you know being lost in the World Trade Center. She has returned every year. I'm going to hold this up to here while you're talking. Provide a meatball dinner to every family so, so. that attends the memorial weekend. Yeah. And uh, so I got to talk to her, and told her you know my husband and I do stair climbs, and I I vowed that one day I would get her son's badge and climb in his honor. And she just gave me a little hug and said, sweetie, God bless you. You know, we have to never forget this. So I, this year I'm, I'm honored to be able to climb for Bob. All right, and that's one. You also have another one here, uh, Jeffrey Joseph Stark, Firefighter Engine 230. How did you uh, meet this person here? So this was the college roommate of a coworker when I was fundraising back in 2018. Um, at work, gentleman said, I'm going to donate $200 to the cause because my roommate, Jeff, went on to become a firefighter in New York, and I want to honor his memory. So I was able to get his badge, and I'll be, I climbed for him that year. So personally, this climb means a lot to you and to your family. How can somebody else get involved? Because you guys have teams yes. that sign up and do this together, right? And TQL has got quite a bit of stairs. Yes. Yeah. Um, they can go. There is cincystairclimb.com is the website that you can go to. And you can register there. You could make a donation or you could join a team if you have friends that have a team. But there are plenty of individual stair climbers out there. So you don't feel like you have to do a team event. CentOS has been behind this for a good while now, right? This will be our third year, and we are hoping that this year is the biggest and best year yet. We have over 536 climbers wow. signed up right now, so it's going to be a great time. That's going to be cool to watch. So it starts, that's coming up this Saturday, 8 in the morning, and again, go to Cincy Stair Climb dot com to get you or your team signed up. Do you have any idea, Jen, how many uh, stairs that they end up climbing? Yes, there are 2,212 stairs. But if you sign up and you think stairs aren't your thing, don't worry. There is a flat track that's approximately two miles long that will be the equivalent to climbing 110 stories. For some folks, that might be a better option. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> Jen, so great having you in. We really appreciate it. Thank Hope you. you have a huge turnout beyond who's already uh, signed up. So maybe if you want to sign up, uh, check out the website and put a few steps in for those and remember those who we lost. Yes. Great to have you here. Thank All you right. so much. We got to take a break. We'll be right back.